Hello everyone, welcome to Aaron's Collecting and Detecting, just coming back at you with another video. I'm a little excited about this video um, because I got two new uh, products in, um, two boxes. Well, the, one of them not new, but it's new for me. Um, but I'm really excited about both. Um, just to let you know how my day went first. Um, went for a walk, it was about 83 degrees, not humid, so it was nice warm but not unbearable perfect actually um had what do we have a uh, hamburger helper for dinner uh hamburger helper um beef stroganoff it's good really good um cheap meal but it was good um watched some old movies some game shows the usual uh got some good mail so i'm pumped um, yeah, that's about it. So, let me show you what I got. Some new Diamond Kings. A hobby box of Diamond Kings. And a box of 2001 Fleer Ultra. And this has... Ichiro and Pujols in it, rookie, I believe. Um, although it says retail, I don't know if it was in the retail, but I don't know. They do have some autographics and some feel the game memorabilia cards. So even if they don't have the Ichiro and the Pujols in there, then I still get, got this for a reasonable price, so, um, yeah, so those, yeah, two, 2001 Ultra cards were pretty cool anyway, um, that's back when Jeter and, uh, Griffey and Bonds and all those players were still playing, so, should be some good cards in there, but I'm not opening this today, this will be tomorrow, I'm opening the Diamond Kings today, so, let me... Pause it and open it up, and then we'll see what we get. Oh, for all those of you who are odds people, they're the odds for everything on the back. This is sealed. So there you go. Now give me a second. Yeah, this is how the inside of a hobby box looks. It says... Uh, 12 packs, 8 cards per pack for a total of, what is that, uh, 96 cards, I believe. Yes, 96, um, which isn't a, a whole t heck of a lot, but I got this at a good price, under $100. So to get a hobby box these days for under $100, I think, is doing pretty good. Um, so, yeah. So let me open a pack, and then I will show what's in it. Give me one second, guys. We're going to start at the front. Okay, first card. Clark Schmidt, rookie. Never heard of him. For New York, is that the Yankees, or for the Mets? I'm mm, not sure. It just says New York. Next card, Ted Williams. Next card, DJ LeMahieu. Here's what the backs look like. Ryan Sandberg. Oh, we already got a hit in our first pack. Um, our first hit is a pat dual patch card of Ryan Weathers. Um, I believe I seen his card in 2019 Bowman, so I know he's not an old older player. He's a younger player, but don't really know much about him except that he's a pitcher. 
Um, but I still got two more hits in there. So put that aside. Um, got an artist palette, Juan Soto. Pretty cool. Any Juan Soto card is a good card. Then I got a Diamond King, debut Diamond King, Dalton Jeffries. Looks to be a rookie to me. Don't really know much about him either. But always rookies are always good. Another rookie, Evan White. So that's the first pack. Let's see what we get for pack number two. Still got two uh, hits to go. Okay, first card, Adonis Medina. Another pitcher. Again, I don't know much about him. Hopefully he turns out to be good. Carl Ers Erskine. You Darvish with San Diego. Weird to see him in a San Diego uniform. A Vlad, Vlad Sr. A Pete Alonzo. The ever popular spacer. Which, for those of you who don't know, it's basically a decoy card to make you think that there's a hit in there, a, a relic, or a relic, uh, or a thicker auto, or a relic auto. This is a Fernando Tatis Jr. Gallery of Stars card. Beautiful card. Fernando Tatis is on his way to being MVP, I believe, if he keeps it up. He's going crazy. Him and him and Vlad, I would say those are the two MVPs so far. Acuna started out that way, but he's cooled off a little bit. Still possible for him to be that, but I don't know. Here's another good rookie diamond debut, Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. He's actually pretty good. Doing he's doing pretty good. And then a George Brett. So that's pack number two. Some good cards so far. Pack number three. One second. Well, earlier you guys saw Senior. And there's Vladdy Jr. A Luis Gonzalez. Another Chicago. That looks like the White Sox. Never heard of him either. Another Tatis. Andres Jimenez. Rookie. I've seen his cards in Bowman. He looks to be more of a fielder than a hitter right now at the moment. Then I got, um, I think you get one red parallel in each box. I got a Joe Cronin. Eh, not my first choice, but I'll take it. Next we have the Art of Hitting, Shoeless Joe Jackson. Yes, he's the one that's involved in the scandal and he's not in the Hall of Fame, but I but I digress. He uh, actually th there's they say he wasn't 
he had no part of it, and he actually did good in that series, but they still um, banned him from baseball. So, obviously, he's not around anymore, and nobody's around to tell the story, so it's hard to say what's true and what's not true, so I don't know. But, uh, pack number four. One second, guys. Real quick, if you weren't able to see the odds on the back because of the cellophane. There you guys can see see them on the back here of the pack. One sec. Oops, it didn't pause. Got a satchel page. Awesome pitcher. A Will Crow rookie. Never heard of him. But then again, I don't have a lot of tops from this year. Or Bowman. Shane Bieber. He's good. A... Monty Harrison, rookie. Hank Greenberg. Hit 50 home runs for Detroit. Don't remember what year he hit 50 home runs. I think in like 30-something. I believe. Another spacer. Lovely. Still got two more hits in this. Oh, this one's awesome. It's Ricky Henderson Legacy Lithographs. It's a cool card. I like that card. Love the color in Diamond Kings. Oh, here we go. Another de debut Diamond King, Casey Mize. From my Detroit Tigers. Cool, cool. And a Tarek Skubal. Another one of my Tigers. Who's doing okay, I guess. Not not that great, but it's his rookie year, so give him some slack. Pack number five. Oh, wait, not eight packs. There's 12 packs, so that's only pack five. It's eight cards per pack. Not eight packs. I misread that. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Nate Pearson. Rookie card for Toronto. A Lou Brock. St. Louis. A Mike Trout. Always good. For the Angels, a Jose Garcia for Cincinnati. Don't think I've heard of him. A Buster Posey, who's having a resurgent year this year. Good for him. A yet another spacer. Another legacy lithograph, Joe Wood. Never heard of him. Have to read that later. A Frankie Lindor for New York Mets. Weird to see him in a Mets uniform. And a Luis Garcia for Washington rookie. I know he did pretty good last year in limited at bats. I think he was the first player born in the 2000s to play in the majors. I believe that's true. Pack number one, two, three, four, five, six. We're halfway through. 
a Jorge Mateo rookie. A Shoeless Joe Jackson card. Black and white. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be. But I would assume yes because it was black and white back in the day on TV. They didn't have color, obviously. Look at the date on that. 1889 born. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Then we got, oh, a Casey Mize rookie like this. I'll take that. I think he's going to be a good one, guys. I really get his rookie cards now while they're somewhat affordable. I don't think he's going to be as good as Verlander, but you never know. Then you got this Ha Song Kim. Never heard of him. Another one of those uh, San Diego players. Oh, we have another hit, and it's a good one. We got a Joey Bart Auto, numbered 92 out of 99. So that should be a good one, guys. That's awesome. That's a good second hit. Then you got an aficionado card, Carl Hubble. Actually, let me put this over there with the Ryan Weathers. The aficionado is a insert. Then we got a Nick Madrigal rookie. That's his regular rookie, not an insert. A Dean Creamer. Never heard of him. Or Kramer. Or Creamer. So that's two hits down, one to go. Another pack number seven, I believe. One sec. Okay. First card. Sixto Sanchez. Which I heard he's supposed to be pretty pretty good. Honus Wagner. Eighteen seventy four. Wow. A Shirton Apostle. Shirtan Apostle, Shirtan Apostle, I don't know, I heard that name, uh, Joe Morgan, a Anthony Rendon aficionado blue, numbered 68 of 99, it's pretty cool, pretty low number. I would call that a hit, too. I'll put that in that pile. Oh, i say the rest of the packs. A Gallery of Stars. Honus Wagner. Two Honus Wagners in the same pack. It's cool. A Raphael Marchand. Don't know him. A Luis Garcia Diamond King. Debut Diamond King. Cool. Pretty good box so far, I'd say. Pack number eight. One sec. Here you go, hats. Christian Javier, rookie. A Eddie Stanky. Funny name, Eddie Stanky. Hey, Eddie, you're Stanky. Eh, whatever. 
a Kebron Hayes rookie. Another big name. Not doing too bad. I saw. Who do you guys think is going to be the rookies of the year? 